All of us adore modern, sophisticated aircraft. What, however, are some of the oldest and most seasoned fighter jets currently in use by militaries? Naturally, a military must use the newest and most cutting-edge technology available if it hopes to maintain an advantage on the battlefield. But there are situations when that is just not feasible. A lack of funds or an unfavorable political climate could prevent the purchase of new fighter jets. Old ones must therefore continue to be used. Let's check out the top 10 oldest figure jets still in service today. Number 10. McCoy Gravich MiG-25, 1970 The MiG-25, a renowned high-speed interceptor that was first flown in 1964 and initially deployed with the Soviet Air Force in 1970, first took flight in 1964. These days, just a small number of these once-dreaded fighters are still in use by the air forces of Algeria, Libya, and Syria. It is also unknown whether the jets are even still in operable condition. Number 9. Sukhoi Su-17, 1970 In reality, this Soviet fighter bomber is a heavily modified Su-7 from the 1950s with swept wings and other improvements. It was also first introduced in 1970 and primarily served as a quick ground attack aircraft. Su-20 was the export model, and Su-22 was the improved model with updated engines, avionics, and armament systems. These are still in use by several nations, including Vietnam, Iran, Poland, and others. Syrian Su-22s have recently played a significant role in the protracted civil war there. By the way, the Harrier jump jet may take this spot instead of another entry. The Harrier, the first fighter plane with vertical takeoff and landing, was unveiled in 1969. Although the previous version of the aircraft was long since decommissioned, the McDonnell Douglas AV-8B Harrier II is currently in use by Spain, Italy, and the United States. Is it a distinct aircraft from the original Harrier? Depending on who you ask, the jet has essentially undergone a complete overhaul, yet some people still view it as merely a variation. As a result, we list it as a partial entry. Number 8. Dassault Mirage 5, 1967 The Mirage 5, which was developed in 1967 from the previous Mirage 3, was more ground assault oriented while still having strong air-to-air -air capabilities. Many of them work for the Pakistani Air Force, which has continuously improved them over time. Many nations continue to use the IAIKFIR version, which was manufactured in Israel. Number 7. Northrop F-5, 1964 The F-5 entered service in 1964 and is one of the few American aircraft that is primarily designed for export. It was affordable, lightweight, and nimble, and it gained popularity all around the world. Many nations, including South Korea, Mexico, Iran, Taiwan, and Switzerland, have upgraded variations in use. Number 6. McDonnell Douglas F-4 Phantom II, 1961 When the storied Phantom initially entered service in 1961, there was a lot of room for improvement. It still makes up a sizable portion of the fighter fleets in Greece, Turkey, Iran, and South Korea's air forces. Number 5. Dassault Mirage III, 1961 In 1961, the first Mirage was released. It is difficult to imagine that this recognizable aircraft was created in the 1950s. Only the Pakistan Air Force still uses Mirage 3s today, principally for ground attacks. Number 4. Sukhoi Su-7, 1959 The Su-7 was primarily designed as a quick, supersonic dogfighter, but it excelled when used for ground attacks. Along with the MiG-21, it entered service in 1959, but it was a slightly more recent development. In the 1970s, a few dozen fighter-bomber variants were shipped to North Korea, where they still are today in an undetermined operable status. Number 3. McCoy Gravich MiG-21, 1959 
being arguably the most commonly utilized fighter jet, the MiG-21 and all of its versions and derivatives continue to hold an impressive amount of appeal among different air forces. The Fish Bed, which was first used by the Soviet Union in 1959, has undergone numerous upgrades, and some claim that with contemporary avionics and weaponry, it can compete with far more recent fourth-generation aircraft. There is a good probability that certain air forces may maintain the jet and keep it operational for decades to come, despite the fact that the majority of notable customers, including India and Romania, are preparing its retirement. We had to give a half-entry thank-out to the 1956 release Douglas A-4 Skyhawk before listing the two oldest airplanes. Is that a jet fighter? No, it is an attack aircraft with a secondary focus on air-to-air -air combat. But was it employed as a weapon? Oh yes. And it is still. It was frequently used by the United States in various training exercises to simulate swift Soviet jets, and the heavily upgraded F-4 AR Fighting Hawk continues to be the main air defense asset of the Argentine Air Force. Number 2. McCoy Norevich MiG-19, 1955. In service since 1955, the MiG-19 was the first supersonic fighter jet developed by the Soviet Union. The first prototype is long gone and is now only found in museums. The Shenyang J-6, a Chinese-made alternative, is still in production today. It is one of the fighters that North Korea has the most of, and several other countries, like Sudan and Myanmar, also operate several of them. Some are even retained as trainers by the Chinese Naval Air Force. Even while it is highly unlikely that all JSIXS in official use are in flyable condition, at least some of them very well could be. Number 1. McCoy Norevich MiG-17, 1952 The MiG-17 was a faster, more powerful version of the famous MiG-15 from the Korean War that could also fire air-to-air -air missiles in some later versions. It first entered service in 1952, and many nations now assert that they are still in use. The majority of those active MiG-17s of, instance, the air forces of Madagascar or Uganda have really spent decades in open storage, waiting for a call to duty in theory but progressively deteriorating and being cannibalized in practice. The Chinese-built Shenyang J-5 may have survived better. According to some accounts, at least half of North Korea's J-5s may be in use. The MiG-17 will continue to be the oldest fighter jet model in use as long as there is at least one flyable example in some air force somewhere in the world. And it will continue to remain that way for a long time. That was everything for our list of the top 10 oldest fighter jets still in service today. If you enjoyed the video, remember to leave a like, and to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos.